leaving the class. So when two, you uh, when new new batch also comes, then what will happen? I will be literally. Hmm? I am the principal has to re is responsible for uh, all the courses in the institute. No, but uh, feedback I should take. Teachers' feedback. I don't know when these students will start teaching. You people, you cannot teach, na? You people can teach to the juniors. As a bonus, what do you Huh? After? Huh? Teaching is a problem. <laughs> you are all of uh, it's looking that everyone is in conference. <laughs> huh? I have I have no conference. I have no conference. Achha, then it's fine, we will give chance. Let's see how you will teach. In the final year we will give them some some portion <coughs> 30 second anushada thirty first we discussed yesterday's class conclusion is what atyahar Simultaneously vibhutvam and also? Uh, Parichinnatvam. Both are existing. So, Sruti, Puranadi, all, they are also saying. Sruti is also saying, which is authenticated by the Madhvacharya. Astu lonur amadhyamo madhyamo vyapako vyapako hari radir anadir avishwo vishwasaguno nirgunaha. Like this. And also from the Nusimhatapani Prashat also we saw. Simultaneously both, both the qualities are existing, which are contradiction to each other. What is the reason for this? How it is possible in the Lord, this kind of Contradiction, how it is possible? Because of the Viruddha Shaktaya. Because he is having the energies, potencies which are acting, contradicting each other. He is having so many Shaktis which are oppo opposite mutually. Next, from the Brahma Purana also we saw Astulo Anurupo Asa Avishwo Vishwa Evacha, like this. And finally, from Bhagavad Gita, seventh chapter of the Bhagavad Gita, from there also, Bra Lord is having some special Aishwaryam, Yoga Aishwaryam. What is that Aishwaryam? Aishwaryam, what kind of Aishwaryam is having? All the living entities are in the Lord. Similarly, all the living entities are not also in the Lord. Both are possible. This is the Aishwaryam.
तदेवं परिच्छिन्नस्यैव तदाकारस्य विभुत्वं पुनर्विद्वत् अनुभवेनोक्त पोषणन्यायेन दर्शयितुं प्रकरणम् आरभते वी आर गोइंग टू स्टार्ट न्यू प्रकरण अ न्यू टॉपिक अमोघ इज नॉट देयर Satprem, Satprem is coming every day or not? I have, huh? Bhagavad Sandarbha class is coming regularly? Before? Huh? Mostly? Okay. Amog. Hare Krishna. Hare Krishna. Okay, we are starting new Anushyada Prabhu. Tadevam parichinna seva tadakarasya vibhutvam punar vidvad anubhavena vukta poshana nyayena darshayetum prakarana marabhate. We are going to start new topic, new prakarana. What is the reason? For what purpose? Till now we have seen Lord is vibhu and also parichinna. Before that... Anushyada 32. Vibhutam finished, Prabhu? Ah, yes, finished. 32nd chapter. 32nd Anushyada. Lord's body is also transcendental. We first established that. After that, that body is also all-pervading. So whatever the body we are seeing, that means with limited form, that itself is also all-pervasive. That also we discussed. Now what we are going to see now? We are once again seeing the same thing. Lord's body is vibhu, that means all pervasive and also it is limited. Both simultaneously it is possible. But what is the speciality in this Anushyada then? This is this prakarana. This we are going to establish by the experience of the scholarly people or by the experience of the pure devotees. The same fact, whatever we discussed, that means Lord's body is simultaneously vibhu, all pervasive, and also it is limited. Parichinnaha. Limited. Limited, covered, which is covered. <coughs> This we are going to establish by the experience of the devotees. So by this what will happen? The same fact that means once again boosted. Boosted by this. Poshan Nyayena. The same fact we are establishing through the experience of scholars or the pure devotees. Same fact we are establishing with the experience of uh, pure devotees. Who is that pure devotee? Brahmaji. Brahmaji also realized. Brahmaji also understood Lord's body is vibhu and also it is parichinna. So he himself is speaking about Lord's body. So that means from his experience we are learning Lord's body is vibhu and also parichinna. What he is saying in the Brahma Vimohan Lila? He himself saying, he is himself glorifying the Lord in this way. Tatra ekadasha padhyanyaha. How many verses we are taking? 11 verses we are taking. From this context we are taking 11 slokas. In the 10th canto, 14th chapter, Lord Brahmaji is glorifying the Krishna. So in that glorification we are taking 11 slokas to establish this fact. From 11 to 
11, 22. Clear? What we are going to do? Are thinking or sleeping? Eleven. Hmm. Hmm, Twenty Kvaham tamo mahadaham kacharagnivarbhu Samveshti tanda ghata sapta vitas vitas kaya Kvedrigvida vigani tanda paranu charya Vata dvaroma vivarasya chate mahitvam Kvaham tamo mahadaham kacharagni varbhu Samveshti tanda ghata sapta vita svikaya Kvedrug vida vigani tanda paranu charya Vata dvaro ma vivarasya chate mahitvam It's good. This is setting actually. Hmm. Translation What am I? A small creature measuring seven spans of my own hand. I am enclosed in a pot like universe composed of material nature. The total material energy, false ego, ether, air, water, and earth. And what is your glory? Unlimited universes pass through the pores of your body just as particles of dust pass through the opening of a screen window. His illusion is gone. <laughs> After that he is realizing. Brahmaji. So he thought what is this small boy? And he is the Master of whole universe, all the universes. What is this? He is stealing the butter. And he is running behind the gopis. What is this thief? This small boy is, is the master of all the universes? I can't believe. And he is a part of my creation. How can we? The creator of everything, no? This was the Brahmaji's conception misconception so that's why he you all know the story he has stolen all the gopas and also cows he kept for the few moments that means one year of the buloka then after that he once again look back what is happening in this Brajamandal goloka whether these boys are there or not and he saw Krishna is there, all his friends, Gopas, everyone is there. All the calves also existing. At the time Krishna was uh, going, that means he is uh, protecting these calves. Not he didn't become, when he became elder, then little bit uh, elder, old, then he took the protecting the cows. But at the er early time he will be given with the, he was given with the calves. All the calves also are there. All his friends, everyone is in the Golok. Then immediately he felt, oh. And he checked where he had hidden that all those cows and the friends. He saw, they are also all there. And he also are all there. So like this, finally he understood. So who is Krishna? Then after understanding Krishna, he is saying, 
क्वाहम तमो महद अहम कचराग्निवार भू संवेष्टितांड घट सप्त वितस वितस्तिकाया आई एम व्हाट इज़ माय साइज़ जस्ट सेवेन हैंड्स हैंड्स माने वन दिस 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 ना दिस हैंड मेंस दिस दिस मच मोरा ये डू मोरल मनुष्य नहीं ना लाइक दिस वन टू थ्री लाइक दिस मैक्सिमम सात सेवेन आई ओनली दिस मच विथ माय हैंड एंड वेर आई स्टे आई स्टे इन ए पॉट लाइक यूनिवर्स which is simply a pot <laughs> and which is made up of earth, water, fire and ether so and so. What is this? And I am challenging the supreme hero, the supreme leader. Kwaham. That means where am I? Kwa, kwa, kwa means kutra. Where am I and where you are? There is no comparison at all. Why? These universes are just entering into your pores. Like how the dust particles enters into the window. When early morning time, when light, sunlight falls, sun, sun rays, so you'll be seeing small dust particles are just roaming. Thousands and hundreds of particles. Like that, all the universes are just like Dust particles in the in the pores of the Lord's body. They are entering into that. That means Lord's body is is such a way. Your body is such a way. Spastam is clear. It's clear already. Jehovah Himself is saying it should be clear. The meaning is clear or not? Utkshe panam garbha gatasya It's not that. Utkshe panam garbha gatasya garbha gatasya padayo kim kalpa matura doksha jagase kim asti nasti vyapadesha bhushitam tavasti kukshe <laughs> it is also wonderful meaning actually it is having translation. O Lord Adokshaja does a mother take offenses when the child within her womb kicks with his legs? Does a mother take offense? When the child within her womb kicks with her, with his legs, and is there anything, is existence, whether designated by various philosophers as real or as unreal, that is actually outside your abdomen. Kimasti nasti vyapadesha bhushitam tava asti kukshehe. Kiyat api anantaha. That is actually outside your abdomen? No, it's not outside your abdomen. Means, my dear Lord, the entire creation is in your stomach. Everything is in your stomach. The point is, in the womb, when child sometimes, that means at the age, at the month of six and seven, so uh, his his limbs started functioning and he will be uh, moving the limbs. Yeah. Who? In, in baby inside. Yeah, yeah. He tries to stay. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> no. <laughs> so, 
So like this, so when infant kicks the mother's stomach, she will never get, take any offense. Similarly, my dear Lord, I am also in your stomach, my creation, everything. So uh, why you will feel any offense because of my ignorance? You will not feel. You always forgive me. <laughs> Good excuse. And is there anything in existence, whether designated by various philosophers as real or as unreal? That means many philosophers, they say this creation is some people, they say it is real and some people say, some philosophers say unreal. Whatever may they speak, but everything is, is in your, in your stomach. So you know, everything enters into the Lord. That is actually, okay. Next. Ataha sarvasya tava kukshigata tvena mama pita tatvam matruvat aparadaha sodavyam iti bhavaha. So everything is in your stomach, like how mother will never take any offense if child kicks. In the same way, you should not take any offense because of me. Aparadaha sodavyam. Uh, just it is a uh, context is body lots bodies is a vibhu so unlimited to say this is yeah that's such a all the universes are in, in his stomach means what his his body is such a big yeah <coughs> Next, kincha visheshatastu tattaha majjanma prasiddham itya. Baba, sleeping? You see, you have to sleep. Yeah. Visheshatastu tattaha majjanma prasiddham itya. That means, my birth from you is very special. Even he is saying, Lord Brahma himself is saying about his birth. That is also special. It's not like other living entities. Brahma's birth is not like other living entities. Jagat, Jagat, Jagat Trayanto Dadi Samplave Samplavo De Narayana Syodara Nabi Nalat Vinirgata Ja Vinirgata Ja Stviti Vardana Wang Sari Wang Na Vai Mrusha Kintvi Shwaratvanna Vinirgato Smi The translation is, my dear Lord, it is said that when the three, planet, three planetary systems are merged into the water at the time of dissolution, your plenary portion, Narayana, lies down on the water. Gradually, a lotus flower grows from his novel and Brahma takes birth upon that lotus flower. Certainly, these words are not false. Thus, am I not born from you? He is giving the proof. I am also in your stomach and I came from your stomach out. First lotus flower came and after that I came. So that means everything in the stomach of the Lord. Everything from there only it will come. From his stomach only, no, ultimately. Why not? Everything came from belly and everything will go into the belly. You have any problem? <laughs> See, from Karnadu, 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 Vishnu, so everything came out from his belly 
and uh, from the garbhodak sai vishnu's s- stomach so from the navel lotus came and from the lotus brahma came so what is the problem no everything is one only lord only na no? that's why yes yes very good you got it my dear lord it is said that when the three planetary systems are merged into the water at the time of dissolution your plenary portion narayana lies down on the water gradually a lotus flower he is saying clear actually your second second purusha so he is lying on the water so he enters into the first purusha is lying on the water so when the universes are Se- separated initially all the universes are at one place as a chunk so those are all separated <laughs> then after that in each universe so karna no sai vishnu in the form of the st- second purusha he enters and that is known as garbhodak sai vishnu he is known as garbhodak sai vishnu yes everyone feeling little drowsy i think huh? pan prasadam पनीर पालक पनीर प्रसाद वन डॉल्स के या इन डॉल्स के सच रियली आई जस्ट पे ओबीसिंसेस टू ऑल ऑफ यू बिकॉज़ यू आर रियली वंडरफुल डिवोटीज नो <laughs> prabhu you can record it so you are all wonderful devotees really you are magnanimous devotees having such a patience hearing hours and hours four hours and that too after eating feast and sitting in the class and hearing so we can understand the dedication of these students i really i really <laughs> eh? Uh, at least sitting and uh, i don't see anyone is sleeping actually still everyone is wake up and sometimes a little bit but otherwise really you are m- yeah really you are all wonderful huh? <laughs> by the mercy of gaur kishor das baba ji maharaj so i got this revelation this revelation i got <laughs> <laughs> really such a patience my god four hours sitting and hearing you know whatever it may be interesting or not interesting but sitting itself is a <laughs> okay thank you abhi sab log thoda sa bhi okay <coughs> So this sloka is clear. Next, tatha api tvat tvatah kim tu not pannos me. What? I didn't come from you? Yes. That means, Brahma ji is requesting. You don't get any angry towards me. Please forgive my offense. I am also, I also came from you. The same thing. In the last Anushyada, whatever we discussed, vivuttom and parichinnatom, that same thing we are establishing but the with f- from the from the experience of pure devotees from the brahma ji's experience we are establishing the same fact okay hmm अभी तो तत्व एव उत्पन्नोस्मी इत्यर्दा हा व्हाट डिड आई डिड आई कम फ्रॉम योर स्टमक यस दैट मींस यस ही आल्सो केम फ्रॉम द स्टमक ऑफ लॉर्ड ननु यद्यहम् प्रलयो धदीशाई नारायणः स्याम तरी मत 
Tarihi, what is this? Mattaha? Tarihi, anyone is following Sanskrit? Tarihi, huh? Tarihi, after that what? Tarihi? Ah, Mattas, okay, okay, okay. That much only, only one letter, no, 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 wait. Tarihi, Mattaha, Tvam Utpanno Si Ityapi Ghatate. Tattu Anyatha Eva Ityashankya. Aha. But now Lord is questioning. Lord is questioning to the Brahmaji. So, so what is questioning? Are Brahmaji? Aham Pralayodhadi Shai Narayana Syam. That means Pralayodhadi Shai means Karnanova. Sai. If I am Karnano Sai Vishnu, Tarihi, then Mattaha Tomutpano Si Ityapi Ghatate. No, no, no. Paralayoda Di Sai. Who is that Paralayoda Di Sai? Garbodak Sai. When Pralaya comes, Wait, wait. Thoda sa preparation ka time kam mila. Chali. Mila hai, lagi ek bar paad chuke hai hum. Ek bar little time. Wait. Thoda sa shanti se rahan diye hum log. No, no. Please. Only in this place. Otherwise, I can go forward. I other, tha, other parts is okay. Now the Puro Pakshi is Lord Himself is a Puro Pakshi. Yadi aham pralayodhadi shai narayanaha syam. That means if I am pralayodhadi narayanaha, pralayodhadi shai means uh, garbha tarhi mattaha tomutpanno si ityapi ghatate. Then it is possible that so. Uh, you came from me, that is possible. Tat, uh, tattu, tattu anyatha eva ityashankya aha. But it is different. Kintu ghatna ko anya prakar kahi. Okay, try to understand like this. Main theme is like this. Who is there in front of the Brahmaji? Krishna is there and what he is speaking, Krishna is asking question, what do you think, if I am Narayana then your words are true, do you think I am Narayana, no, 
I am, I am Krishna. I am the superior to the Narayana. That is the question actually. Hey Brahmaji, what do you think? Eh? What do you think? Do you think I am Narayana? Oh yes, if you, if you think I am Narayana, then you can say you are coming from me. But it's not like that. So then Brahmaji, yes, yes, it's not like that. You are different from the Narayana. Like this, is, this sloka is coming. In this sloka, he is showing difference between the Narayana and Krishna. Because it's a very important sloka in the Krishna Sandarbha we discuss very elaborately this. Krishna is different from the Narayana. What he is saying now, Brahmaji? Ah, yes, yes, my dear Lord, you are not Narayana. You are Krishna. Sloka is Narayanas Narayanas Tvam Nahi Sarva Dehinam Atma Syadisha Kila Loka Sakshi Narayanonga Narabhu Jalayanat Tachapi Satyam Nataveva Maya Narayana Tvam Na Tvam means you, Narayana, na. You are not Narayana. Brahmaji himself is accepting now. Lord asked na question, then immediately, yes, you are not Narayana. Narayana, tvam. translation is like this. I will read out just translation. So, are you not the original Narayana, O Supreme Controller, since you are the soul of every embodied being and the eternal witness of all created realms? Indeed, Lord Narayana is your expansion. He is, it is like question it is asked, but there is no question in the translation, but it is clearly say, is saying, you are not the Narayana. But Narayana is your Amsha. Narayana Angaha, Angam. Narayana is the, is the part and parcel of yours. He is your expansion and he is called Narayana because he is the generating source of the primal water of the universe. He is real, not product of your illusory Maya. So Narayana is real and he is not the product of the Illusory Maya. Okay, now the uh, commentary is there, big commentary. <coughs> hmm? It will come, Prabhu, in the commentary. It is every, every line, every word is once again covered in this. He Adisha, it is a Sambodhan in this. He Adisha, Ishasya Sarvantar Yaminaha Narayanasya Upari Vartamana. What, what Brahmaji is addressing, how he is addressing the Krishna? He Adisha, Adisha, Adi, he didn't say Isha, he said Adisha, means Ishasya Sarvantar Yaminaha. Narayanasya upari vartamana. You are on the top of the Narayana. Isha is the Narayana and Adhisha means you are the, on the top of the Narayana. He Bhagavan ityardaha. That means Bhagavan. Who is the Bhagavan? Krishna. Krishna is the Bhagavan. He Bhagavan ityardaha. He Nishitam. Here he is there, Nishitam. It's a so na, confirm, Nishitam, confirm. Saha Narayana Tvam Nasi, you are not Narayana. Tvam Narayana Na Asi. 
किंतु नारायण असौ तथा एव अंगम अंशः बट दिस नारायण इज द युवर अंग पार्ट एंड पार्सल गेटिंग यद्यपि ये सो दैट्स व्हाई इफ श्री वैष्णव आज दे सी दिस काइंड ऑफ कमेंट्री देन हाउ दे कमेंटेड यू शुड अंडरस्टैंड बिकॉज़ दे थिंक कृष्णा इज़ आल्सो इज़ इज़ अवतार ऑफ़ दी नारायणा एंड दे में ट्राई टू प्रूव दैट वी शुड सी द वेरा राघवाचारी कमेंट्री ऑन दिस हाउ ही इज़ राइटिंग and also in the third canto first chapter first canto third chapter also we see so krishna sthu bhagavan swayam how it is commented that also we should see many many the logics actually see uh, defeating the advaitins is not so easy that means any opinion difference with the advaitins it can be easily settled but opinion difference with the vaishnavas is also one of the important fact is one of important thing very scrutinizingly it should be dealt so here you see narayana is also is is said as angaha but we should see how they commented edyapi evam athapi mama tad angotpannatvad anginah tvattah eva utpattir iti bhavah then why hey brahma ji why you said i am your child i am came from you just know what you said if mother that means if infant kicks mother with the feet then mother will not take offense similarly you also should not take offense like that he said and after that i am also coming from you ha huh? so okay that's true okay that means at that time we are thinking that he is uh, directly understanding krishna as narayana and now he is saying you are not narayana then how why did you say why did you say like that krishna can ask na then he, he is saying brahma ji is saying why i said because this narayana is also your anga your amsha that's why i said <laughs> ultimately everything you only na that is your part and parcel only na that's why i said i am your child mama tad angotpannatvad anginah tvattah eva utpattir iti bhavah katham maso narayana uchyate katham va mama tasmad vai lakshanyam now lord is asking hey why you are saying him as narayana what is the meaning of narayana you tell me why you are saying him as narayana and how i am different from him that also you should explain now remaining part of this shloka is doing that khatam asau narayana uchyate how that person is known as narayana and khatam mama tasmad vai lakshanam how i am different from narayana you tell this tatra aha to answer this brahma ji is saying यह असौ देही नाम आत्मा अंतर्यामी पुरुषः अतएव नारस्य जीव समूहस्य अयनम आश्रयः यत्र इति तस्य नारायणत्वम नाउ सी द श्लोक सर्व देही नाम आत्मास्यादेशा किल लोक साक्षी This is sarva dehi nam atma. What is the meaning of Narayana? He is saying, Brahma ji. Now what Krishna asked question? What question asked Krishna? Huh? Sadhu Swaroop Prabhu, tell me. Ah, uh, and uh, how I differ from and what is Narayana? Why he is called as Narayana? That you should answer first. So uh, why he is known as Narayana? Tirumala. everyone is now slowly slowly going to the sleeping mood yeah hare krishna hare krishna 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 hare 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 ram hare ram 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 hare hare weather is also so cold and if we sleep now i think at least 4 5 hours <laughs> nicely they can sleep <laughs> good time actually really so 
weather is also very much cooperative <coughs> now you see why he, uh, how can how wh what is the definition of narayana that brahma ji has to explain now brahma ji is saying sarva asau that means this narayana dehi naam atma dehi naam atma means he is the antaryami paramat atayeva that's why since he is antaryami then atayeva narasya mane jeeva samuhasya ayanam aashraya yatra iti narayanatvam first definition of the narayana is what he is a shelter for the all the living entities all the living entities he is a shelter how he is shelter he is antaryami antaryami means antaryami is the is a is a resting place for all the jivatmas if antaryami is not there in that body jivatma also cannot stay it cannot do anything so brahma ji said you are the uh, narayana is antaryami that much is sufficient to say the definition total definition you can take that means he is antaryami means he is a shelter for all the jivatmas all the jivatmas means naram the the total jivatmas are known as naram and uh, ayanam means shelter so narasya means of the total jivatmas narasya means for all for, for of total jivatmas ashrayam means shelter yatra means where where the way where there is shelter for shelter of all the living entities that is narayana narasya jeeva samuhasya ayanam yatra saha narayana can anyone repeat नारस्य जीव समूह से अयन आश्रयो यी तस् नारायण नेक्स्ट साक्षात भगवत तव तो तदंतरियाम अभी औदासीन्यम भाव देन वाट इज द डिफरेन्स भाई हौ द यू कृष्ण इज डिफरेन्ट फ्रॉम द नारायण दट आलो यू शुड आंसर ना टू क्वेश्चन यू आस्ट वाट इज नारायण एंड हौ कृष्ण इज डिफरेन्ट फ्रॉम द नारायण सो नौ वाट इज नौ ब्रह्मा जी सेंग ए कृष्ण हि इज नारायण एंड हि इज रिसाइडिंग इन एवरी वन हार्ट but you are not living in anyone's heart directly krishna is living in the heart of everyone no krishna never lives krishna lives in in devotee's heart not in everyone's heart eh? Eh? Yeah. ah ishwar in bhagavad gita also you should understand like that अहम सर्व से नहीं अहम सर्व से हृदय सन्निवेश मेनी प्लेस लाइक दिस इवन इन द प्रीवियसली व्हेन वी आर डिस्कसिंग भक्ति संदर्भ देर आल्सो इट दिस काइंड ऑफ डिस्कशन केम हाँ देर यू शुड टेक इन द फॉर्म ऑफ अंगा ही एंटर साक्षात भगवत तव तो तदंतरियामितायासीन्यम भाव दट मीन अंडरस्टांडिंग इज वाट सो हिईज परमात्मा मीन यू आर् नाट परमात्मा हिईज थीफ मीन टू पीपल आर् देर युवर सेंग हिईज थीफ मीन हिईज नाट थीफ 
and that means he is saying brahma is saying narayana is the is the paramatma in every living entity is antaryami living entity means krishna is not antaryami that is the difference he is showing see how each and every word actually bringing and the the the, the philosophy entire philosophy is coming out so narayana is different and krishna is different that philosophy is clearly coming out how to fetch it how to take it out that we should know that is the jiva goswami kincha what else only this much तदंतर्यामितायाम अपी औदासीन्यम इति भावः साक्षात भगवतः माय डियर कृष्ण यू आर डायरेक्टली लॉर्ड यू आर सुप्रीम लॉर्ड डायरेक्टली तव तू दैट मींस इवर तदंतर्यामित्व अंतर्यामितायाम दैट मींस बिकम इन अंतर्यामी दैट मींस बिकमिंग अंतर्यामी इज इन दैट in that case you are neutral tadantaryamitayam audhasinyatvam means you are neutral to become antaryami becoming of antaryami in that case in that in that scene in that case you are neutral you are neutral means you don't become antarya antaryamitayam antaryamita means sup uh, uh, antaryamita means uh, super soulless super soulless in the super soulless you have neutrality means you are not concerned means you are not becoming super soul then who is becoming super soul narayana antaryamitayam audasinyatvam tava little sanskrit if you learn actually it's like cake walk total krishna will never become antaryami that is a mean Oh, that we should not bring that philosophy. That philosophy, if you bring, then ah, that's all. He is neutral. He is neutral. Neutral for what? Huh? Ah, he is neutral means he is not uh, participating to become. He is not becoming antaryami. That is the mean. He is neutral. Who you are may become. I don't care. That means Narayan is becoming antaryami, not Krishna. ah krishna is udasina here krishna is udasina for what to become antaryami to become antaryami krishna is udasina tirumala you got it huh? yes or no Oh, you want me explain once again? <laughs> no, <laughs> smiling is why. I don't know. <laughs> Prabhu is Udasina means what? So he is not becoming an Antaryami. That is the meaning actually Udasina. 
he he is permanently udasina is not at all sad udasina means udasina means neutral neutral for eating prasadam neutral for so seva like that for activity one activity will be that means i have i don't i don't interfere in this activity means i am neutral ah uh, that is the point he is not he is neutral for what to become parmatma antaryami ha huh? కించ ఓకే అఖిల లోక సాక్షి వాట్ ఎల్స్ యు సి ద శ్లోక సర్వదేహినాం ఆత్మ ఈజ్ ఫినిష్డ్ ఆఫ్టర్ దట్ వాట్ ఈస్ దేర్ అదీషా ఈజ్ ఆల్సో ఫినిష్డ్ వాట్ ఈస్ రిమైనింగ్ యు సి ద శ్లోక రీడ్ ది శ్లోక సి कोई भी श्लोक पढ़ो तो जो मन लगेगा वाट एवर श्लोक यू लाइक वो श्लोक वी आर डिस्कसिंग टेल मी हाँ दैट ओनली ना वी आर डिस्कसिंग इन दिस नाउ व्हाट है ना या इन दिस व्हाट वी फिनिश्ड व्हाट वर्ड वी डिड टिल नाउ ఇన్ ది శ్లోక వాట్ వర్డ్ వాట్ వర్డ్ వి ఫినిష్ టిల్ నో థోడాస్ యాక్చువల్లీ ఇఫ్ యూ పీపుల్ ఆల్సో యు ఆర్ హియరింగ్ ఐ అండర్స్టాండ్ యాక్చువల్లీ ఐ కెన్ అండర్స్టాండ్ యు ఆర్ గ్రాస్పింగ్ ది కంటెంట్ అండ్ ఆల్సో ఇఫ్ యూ టేక్ వన్ మోర్ స్టెప్ ఫర్దర్ and see from which word from where i am explaining this that means which word is explained in the text how i am explaining this also you should learn slowly not only just content you are grasping content but how i am explaining from where i am explaining how uh, this process is going on that you should also grasp ah that is we are talking that is finished sarvadehi naam atma me so, to explain this much word what we said we we made a background what background we made so krishna is asking two questions hey brahma ji so you are so you are saying i am not narayana okay fine so then what is the definition of narayana and how i am different from the narayana this question is asked then to answer this question that means we this question is not there in the shloka but we are assuming that we are assuming that question is possible and uh, that question is assumed and to answer this so uh, the word is coming what word sarva dehi naam atma sarva dehi naam atma is a definition for the narayana how it is definition what is the meaning of narayana narasya jeeva samuhasya ayanam yatra saha so that means sarva dehi naam atma means sarva dehi naam atma the one which is in the in heart of the everyone means paramatma is existing in everyone that means paramatma is shelter for everyone that means narayana is nothing but the paramatma who is the shelter for everyone every living entity so that's why so sarva dehi naam atma from this we are understanding that paramatma is the shelter for everyone that means narasya a very living entity means narasya shelter means ayanam so yatra sah okay so narayana definition we are seeing from the sarvadehina atma we are seeing the definition of narayana that first question is answered and how he is different from narayana so that is also said here how krishna is different from the narayana that also answered na that second question that is also answered how he is he is paramatma he is antaryami means you are not antaryami a difference a difference hum log established ki aa gaya samajh mein ha style aisa aa gaya 
कैच कैच मैंने ऐसा पकड़ेंगे तो इफ यू कैच दी टेक्स्ट देन यू विल एनी टाइम यू कैन ओपन बुक एंड इमीडिएटली कैन एक्सप्लेन टू एनी वन नेक्स्ट वॉट द वर्ड वी इज इज पेंडिंग इन द स्लोक यू सी यू टेल मी वॉट द वर्ड इज रिमेन नेक्स्ट वर्ड इज उधर क्यों गए आ रहे हैं आप कहां तक किए हम लोग फटिल वाट वी डिड सर्वदेही नाम आत्मा आत्मा उसके बाद वाट हाउ टू यू नो यू शुड नो संधि विच यू नो संधि देन हाउ कैन आत्मा असी असी आफ्टर अधीशा आत्मा सधीशा आत्मा सधीशा मीन्स आत्मा असी अधीशा आत्मा सधीशा आदि नहीं असी असी प्लस अधीशा इट विल बिकम सधीशा अस्यधीशा असी प्लस अधीशा इट विल बिकम वाट विल बिकम यान संधि सधीशा अस्यधीशा असी प्लस अधीशा इज इक्वल टू अस्यधीशा रिमेम्बरिंग देवदात्री माता जी असी प्लस अधीशा अस्यधीशा सो ही दर्श अधीशा इज ऑलरेडी डन बाय वर्ड अधीशा आल्सो वंस अगेन वी आर सीइंग द डिफरेंस बिटवीन द नारायण एंड कृष्ण नारायण इज ईशा एंड कृष्ण इज अधीशा and what is the next word akila loka sakshi this word you should take now kincha it is starting the explanation of this word is starting from the kincha kincha akila loka sakshi means yasmat akilam lokam sakshat pashyati tasmat naram नारमयते जानाति इति नारायण असौ तम पुनः तेन अंशेन तद्रष्टा न तो साक्षात इति तस्माद विलक्षण इत्यर्थः वंस अगेन द डेफिनेशन ऑफ नारायण इज सेड हियर व्हाट अकील लोक साक्षी मीन्स व्हाट the one who sees entire creation akila loka means entire creation who is that krishna no that is narayana here what is said are shloka actually how the shloka is going narayana tvam na asi this is na what kind of narayana sarvadehina matma what kind of narayana akila loka sokshi narayana these are all the visheshanas you are not the narayana you are not the sarvadehina matma you are not the akil lok sakshi also you should take ah these are all the visheshanas to the narayana and finally we are saying you are not narayana that means he is not akil lok sakshi and he is not sarvadehina atma जरूरी है सब ओके इज इट नेसेसरी व्हाई यू आर गोइंग टू मच कम वॉक विथ अस वॉक विथ अस डोंट गो फॉरवर्ड एक्चुअली आर डोंट गो डोंट बी बिहाइंड गो विथ अस because when a explanation if you do it should be contextual and also it should be philosophical and like that anyway now agil lok sakshi you should see ha ah. Nothing, Prabhu. Direct it is. Direct explanation. 
direct explanation. Brahmaji is there and Krishna is standing in front of him and Brahmaji is praying, you are not Narayana. What kind of Narayana? Who is the Sarvadehina Matma and who is the Akilok Sakshi? Directly we are explaining. Ari Baba, what is the sloka is what he is saying. Tvam Narayana na asi. You are not Narayana, he said na. Direct he is saying that sentence itself. Jiva Goswami is not doing any extra work. That sloka itself is saying you are not na. Brahmaji himself is saying you are not Narayana. So from there only we are speaking. Narayana, Narayana means what? Sarvadehina Matma. That is one definition for Narayana. Another definition is? Akila Lok Sakshi. From Akila Lok Sakshi also you should bring out the Narayana definition. That you should see. How he is doing you see. Yasmad Akilam Lokam Sakshat Pashyati. Who's? Mera hai nahi. Okay, tasmat naram mayate janati iti nara. Prabhu? What Prabhu? It is our, our universe only. This this whole story happened uh, in this in this universe. So, what is the definition of Akilok Shakshi? Akilam Lokam Sakshat Pasiti. The one who sees the entire creation. This is the meaning of Akilok Sakshi. Now, you should bring out the meaning of Narayana from this definition. Now, you see, Akila Lokam means Naram. Yes? Naram means entire Jiva Samoham. Pasiti means Ayate. What is the, uh, another word for the Pashyati? Ayate. Naram Ayate Iti? Narayana. Naram means Akila Lokam. Ayate means Pashyati. Match ho gaya? Akila Loka Sakshi is equal to Narayana. We got or not? Tirumala, you explain. Why you are not writing manuscript? Yeah? You have a problem? No, no. You already know all this? Uh, tell. N here, Nara means the whole universe, Jiva. Akila Lokam. Akila Loga, mm. loga Jiva. That is lokam. Akila Lokam, mm. Jiva. That is Nara. Mm. And here, the word is Pasiti is there. That mm. is another one meaning is Ayate. Ayate. Uh. So, Ayate and Nara is equal to Ayate. Narayana. That means the Naram Ayate. Naram Ayate. Iti Narayana. Iti Narayana. Hmm. So he is only Narayana, he is seeing everyone. That Nara is hey. Pashati. That is na Akila Loka Sakshi. Akila Loka Sakshi. Akila Loka Sakshi, write it. Akila Loka Sakshi. Sakshi means seer. Akila Lokam witness. He witnessed the entire creation. Who sees 
are witness entire creation so now i am bringing one more meaning you can write akila loka actually like this akila loka means naram sakshi when sees ayate ayate is a kriya is equal to narayana Tvam punaha, but you are not Narayana means Lord is not directly seeing. Krishna is not directly. You are not Narayana means he is not directly seeing the loka, but he is seeing through his amsha. Okay, you always bring this kind of. That means this kind of difference also you should maintain, and also you should explain. You are not directly doing this. Krishna ka kam hai kya? Is it Krishna's duty seeing everyone? He is enjoying. He is enjoys in his log, in Goloka. Na iha the, aniha. Yesterday we studied na. He is simultaneously doer and also non-doer. clear tvam that means brahma ji told about narayana then what what about krishna oh my dear lord tvam na that means you are not narayana means you are not directly seeing the things but you are also seeing if you say that means that means with lord he doesn't have any connection yeah he has connection he is seeing through the amsha that means narayana is amsha so through that amsha he is seeing tad drashta na tu sakshat that means lord is not seeing the living entities directly iti tasmad vilakshana in this way different krishna is different from the narayana ah uh. hmm you all should explain like this who is narayana and who is krishna ha ah. tarhi sah narayana tvam na bhavasi iti mama api anyatha narayana narayana tvam asti iti bhavata abhipretam tatkatam okay now lord is asking one more ओके सह नारायण तम न भवसी दट मीन्स ए ब्रह्मा सो यू आर सेइंग दैट यू आर डिफरेंट फ्रॉम द नारायण हु इज सेइंग ब्रह्मा जी इज सेइंग दैट यू आर डिफरेंट फ्रॉम द नारायण एस आर नो देन ब्रह्मा so i i am not narayana mama api anyatha narayanatvam asti iti bhavata abhipretam that means i am not directly narayana but in in another way anyatha means another way narayanatvam asti even i am also narayana in another way so what is that way you tell me now in what way i am narayana if i am not narayana then in what way i am narayana you tell me if i am not directly narayana in what way i am also narayana that you tell me getting tat khatam hmm hmm Hmm. 
This is Brahmaji's point. Saha Narayana Tvam Nabhavasi That Narayana You are not that Narayana. Who is saying this? Who, will can, who can say this? Brahmaji can say. Iti, that means this kind of opinion Brahmaji is having. So Krishna is asking in this opinion, based upon this opinion. Hey Brahma, you have opinion that, so I am different from the Narayana, you have this kind of opinion. Then, in what way I am Narayana, you tell me. If I am not directly Narayana, in what way? Anyatha, that means in another way, in other way. So, Narayana, so how I can become Narayana, you tell me then. That is the coming answer. What? Beginning means what? You come from the proper place. Which sloka you are saying? Beginning means? In this sloka you are saying? Topic or sloka you tell me first? Topic. Ah, topic. Okay. In the topic what? How we started our topic? So our topic started, that means Brahmaji's place, how it started? So first of all, wait. You want to say? Okay. So first what he is saying? My, just what is my height? I am just seven, seven hands of the height. And I am living in a pot like universe. Where you are and where I am. What is the comparison? There is no comparison. And these all small, small parts are like just dust particles entering into your pores. Like in the window, the small dust, pa dust particles enter in the way, the same way, these all dust particles are, these universes are entering into your body. So your body is such a big. So that means, here what, here directly he is saying, that means, uh, what opinion Brahmaji is having, Narayana is Krishna only. In that opinion, he said. In the next sloka also, he said. In the next sloka also, what he said? So, so the, like a mother, that means small boy kicks, Mothers in the mother's stomach, but still mother will not take any offense. Similarly, all these universes, and I am also in your universe, in your stomach, then if any offense commits I, so you should not take it seriously. The example also he gave. Then that means here also his opinion is, you are Narayana. Then also he said, Are not only, how can I say I am from, I am in your stomach? Because I took birth from your Novel, that means from your novel, lotus flower came and from that lotus flower, I came. So like this he said. So that means still here also, uh, Brahmaji is showing Krishna is only Narayana. Then, then what? Tathapi tvattvattaha kim nu na utpannosmi abhitu tvattaheva nanu ah. Then Krishna asked one question. Hey, after hearing this much, Krishna asked one question. What is that? No, no. Yadi aham pralayo dadi shayi narayana syam tarhi mattaha tvam utpanno asi ityapi ghatate tattu anyatha eva ityashankya aha. So then, hey, then Krishna asked, you took birth from me? If I am the narayana, that means you took birth from me. But I am not Narayana. That means Krishna is having this kind of opinion. Immediately Brahmaji grasped this. Oh, Krishna may think that the, so I am equating Narayana with the Krishna. So that's why immediately he said, oh, no, 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 no. So I, till now I said you are Narayana, but actually you are not Narayana. That is the sloka. You, our sloka started. Narayana stvam nahi. Tvam nahi means you are not Narayana. Wait, wait, here first. So, you are not Narayana, he heard this. Then after that, two questions Krishna asked. Okay, if I am not the Narayana, give me the definition of the Narayana. Give me the definition of the Narayana and after that, how I am different from the Narayana, you tell. Then he said, Narayana means Sarvadehina Matma. 
that means sarva dehina atma means uh, that mean, uh, naram means jiva samuha jiva samuhasya ayanam yatra saha this is one definition sarva dehina atma is equal to narayana and but that is you are not you are not narayana but your amsha is doing okay and after that one more definition he gave akila loka sakshi this is also one more kincha means one more definition so akila loka sakshi means akila loka means naram sakshi means pashyati means ayate naram ayate iti narayana this is one more definition he gave so in this way two definitions he gave and the definition for the narayana and you are not that narayana that means you are not do seeing the the entire universe directly and also you are not holding this entire universe entire universe is not so you are not residing in everyone's heart directly okay these two conclusions came like this krishna is different from the narayana and also definition of the narayana both we saw clear what is your question you ask now sakshat iti tasmad vilakshana ityardha like this he is yaksha now the krishna is asking one question okay okay my dear brahma so that narayana is different from me okay fine then you tell me you tell me mama api anyatha narayanatvam asti iti bhavata abhipretam tat katham so previously what he said before this shloka in this in these three shlokas he said you are the narayana na yes or no so how what is that opinion you tell me in that means you have some opinion that i am also narayana how is that that opinion you clarify yes or no tirumala you got adakshar prabhu no is going up okay dendra trimata ji you got ha huh? okay you explain to adakshar prabhu after narayana tvam asti iti bhavata abhipretam tat katham so you have opinion that i am also narayana how that is you tell you explain now ityasya uttaram tena eva sambandhena vinjayati so that is now is 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 said here the reply for this question is said adhisha iti even adhisha is also is proving the narayanatvam of the krishna narayanatvam of the krishna adisha word is also proving what narayanatvam of the krishna adisha this is proving the word adisha is proving narayanatvam of the krishna how that you want to comment uh, here uh, uh, yeah we'll see no he's started saying that's why you want to say adi <laughs> No, no. You are guessing. Adisha specifically, you should say, na? No? Don't. Adisha from that word, you should say. This word is saying Krishna is also Narayana. This word is proving the Narayana tvam of the Krishna. How? That we should see. Isha means what? Pravarta kaha. Tatascha. narasya ayanam pravrutir yasmat sa narayana ha how many definitions of narayana three we are first one is naram ayanam nukai nai nai narasya naram nai 
Narasya Hayanam Yatra Saha. This is one. This is equal to Narayana. Write it. Narasya Hayanam. This, what is the context for this? Sarvadehinam. Uh, from this we took this. Jago Jeeva Jago. Next, second definition. Naram Ayate Iti Narayana. What is the root? What is the base for this? Akila Loka Sakshi. Muni, why you are sitting there? You are not able to see. <laughs> Problem. Okay. Akila Loka Sakshi. Next. Third. Uh, Naram. Uh. Narasya. Ayanam. Ayanam means here pravartakaha. Pravartakaha. Here ayanam means ashrayaha. You write in the bracket ayanam means you should write in the bracket ashrayam. In the first one. In the la third one ayanam means you should write. Uh, Pravartakaha. Pravartakaha. No, no, Pravartakaha. Pravartakaha. Sorry. Pravartakaha. 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 Ayanam means Pravartakaha. Yasmat Saha. Yasmat Saha. This is Narayana. Pravartakaha means uh, uh, action. The, act, the action, the action of the jivas from whom he is Narayana. Narayana. Jivas, living entities. From whom? So jivas, they are raising the hand, they are seeing, walking, because of what? This pravurti is because of what? Because of the paramatma, Narayana. Atma. Because of the Paramatma. So this is, this is the third definition. Okay? So this, we, what is the context for this? Adhisha. Adhisha. Okay? So from Isha means what? Isha means Pravartakaha. Isha means the one who calls for the action. Pravartakaha. Pra va pravartakaha. Isha means pravartakaha. Huh? So adhisha means anarasya. Uh, sorry. Isha means pravartakaha. From this you got the ayana means pravurti you took. Isha means pravartakaha. Now narayana means what? Narasya ayana means pravurti yasma saha narayana. Uh, cause for the actions. Huh? Oh, time. Huh? What we should do? Now the class is coming now slowly, slowly into the form. Yes, now. 
Yeah. Oh, let me finish this. Huh? Last one, Adisha part. Five minutes I will take. Na? Okay? Five, seven minutes. <laughs> Ishaha means pravartaka and Narayana means Narasya Ayanam means pravurtihi yasmat saha Narayana. So now you should prove how Krishna is also Narayana that you should prove. Narayana Tvamabdi Krishna should be proven. Ishaha means Pravartakaha and Adishaha means Ishaha can be Ishaha means Pravartakaha. So ultimately here, eh, Narasya Ayanam Yasma Saha. That means Ayanam means Pravurti Yasma Saha means Narayana. Means what it is? Meaning is Pravarta Kaha. Yes or no? Narasya means, I am la, last one I am explaining, third one. Narasya ayanam means pravrutti yasma saha. That will come from this. He from whom actions of all living entities. He is Narayana. That means he is pravartakaha. Yes or no? Getting or not? Tirumala? Kisse? Pravurti hota hai. Kisse pravurti hota hai. Jisse, man yasmat means jisse pravurti uh, jivonka pravurti hota hai. Vaha kon hai? Vaha Narayana. Vahi pravartaka hai. So Narayana means Ishaha means pravartaka hai. Hmm. Yes. Yes. Okay, it is clear now. Now, now what, what we got? Ishaha is equal to Narayana is equal to Pravartaka. This much we did. Yes? Now Krishna is what? Adisha. Like now his example is given. That means Krishna is also Pravartaka. Means Krishna is also Narayana. Now you catch it. <laughs> what we established till now, Ishaha means Pravartakaha means Narayana. Now Krishna is Adishaha means he is also special Pravartakaha means he is also Narayana. Narayana. So like how example is, like the, in the, there is a the Mandaleshwaraha. That means someone who is in charge for this some reason of the kingdom and he is also known as king and also who is top on him, he is also known as king. Yes or no? So similarly here, Narayana is Ishaha, Krishna is Adishaha. Ishaha means Narayana, Adishaha means also Narayanatvam is there or not now? Isha means Narayanatvam. Ishatvam means Narayanatvam. So Adishatvam means Narayanatvam is there, there also. In this way, Krishna, in the Krishna also, Narayanatvam is, is there. Ah. The, both you will call Raja only, na? Both you will call Raja. That means, Sri Krishna sa eva sakshat swayam bhagavatve tasmadapi paratvam. So, like this, yatha mandaleshuropi nrupatihi tesham adipaha api nrupatir iti. You, manda, the one who is in charge for the sum zone and the one who is in charge for the total area, both him you call as Drupati. Drupati means king. So similarly here, Isha and Adisha. Both are Isha. Isha and Adisha are also known as Isha. So that's why Krishna is also Narayana. Thank you very much. Still a Prabhupada ki.